So, this is actually going to be kind of like talkative. I'm going to take inspiration from Angatama. I, th I think that's her handle. Um, she usually talks about when she does her hauls, and that's what I'm going to start trying to do. So yeah. Okay. So we just got three books this time, as you saw. Um, we got two toilet bun, Hanako-kun. I finally gave in, so I had to buy them, because I finished What the Koi! Okay, so, I actually have a list of what I wanted to buy. I don't know if I'll show it, but it should, it might be, it'll show up somewhere. So, I wanted to finish... Uh, buying all of What the Koi that's out right now. I'm waiting for volume 5. I think that comes out in October. So yeah, I'm just waiting for volume 5 with both volumes 9 and 10 in them. But I got the rest of What the Koi! Huh. I was, I've been really wanting to finish the series because it's just amazing. I haven't seen the anime. Um, I read it, I fell in love with it, and I got the rest of the series ASAP. So now I finally finished it, and I don't have to worry about that yet until the fifth book comes out. And then the next series I wanted to get was Toilet Bound. So yeah, we just got these. Um, volume 4 is on back order for Barnes & Nobles, so I'll order that as soon as possible. Um, I think y'all have already seen the covers, but hey. New channel for a new account, so yeah. Um, I try not to flip through the pages that often because spoilers, obviously. But look how good the art is, like, ah! <laughs> so yeah. And then I got the recent volume, volume 9, because these are honestly um, in better condition than other ones, because I think Toilet Bound or maybe just Yen Press has a history of not having good uh, covers. Like, as good covers as, like, Viz or something. So yeah. I've got volume 9. Um, obviously I'm not going to read these yet because I don't have volumes 4 or 6 through 8. They have volume 6, but it wasn't in as good condition as I wanted it to be. So yeah. But I got all of them! So I'm really happy about that. I just don't know where they're going because, yeah. Oh, last thing. The reason I went to Barnes & Nobles is because I knew they had Watakoi, these volumes, and I wanted to pick up one more volume, which is volume 45 of Haikyuu, the ending of Haikyuu, because I wanted to relive it as the Tokyo Olympics are ending, because this is August 5th, I believe. And I wasn't able to, get, or they had it on my Barnes & Nobles, it's just the spines are misaligned, and let me tell you, that is the most annoying thing when you see perfect hovers and then the spine is misaligned. Like, it's just really annoying. So, we didn't get it. We will get it at some point, just sadly it wasn't today. So, yeah. But we got them! Ah! I'm really excited because it's just less books I have to read or buy later on. So, yeah. On to the, um... Shelving, which you'll see me contemplate life yet again. So here's my cart yet again. Um, so I'm like by myself with my dogs at the moment. So if they show up at any point, I say hello to my dogs yet again because they made a what's it called? They were in a July haul or June haul. So yeah. Okay. So as you can see, all of Haiku Jujitsu, which I probably can't get the volumes seven through nine yet. For a while and volume zero so yeah so i'm gonna just see how well they fit over here because honestly they might fit i just don't know really <laughs> so yeah so half the okay so i'm doing this um editing this part is actually really easy because it's usually really short the only issue is i always have issues like figuring out what to take out what to put in that kind of stuff and it's stuck I don't know why it's stuck. Is it my heels? Oh, this my heels. Oh, boss. Okay, so got these and my heels in the back. Which I didn't get a volume of recently just because I haven't caught up to the volumes I'm reading at the moment. Hello? Thank you. Yay, they went in. So, yeah. So, it's a... Because uh, I bought... A bunch of volumes recently as you can see in the july haul which will obviously be posted beforehand maybe i'll leave it in the corner i don't know but yeah here is my lovely haul that or er, cart shelf that i absolutely adore okay 
So we have Ron and Hermione here. I wish they made like a bunch of other ones, but or they have like Bellatrix, Nagini, and Voldemort, but that's about it. So I would put them here. It's just that I officially have no more room. Not really. I could just stack them, but like it's like this could fit. No, it can't. No, it can't. No, it can't do that. Don't do that. So I might just. can't even do that okay well it's not ideal but it works so yeah and we are back today from barnes and nobles i feel like this angle is a little odd it's definitely not a normal angle but a we live for a new angle <laughs> So I did get two regular books and one manga. Um, so we'll do the manga first. Um, so we have Toilet Ban, Hanako-kun, volume 6. They actually had a pretty decent looking volume, which I'm really happy about. The only issue is just like a little nick up here, but that's like fine. So now I just need 4, 7, and 8 to complete the collection of what's out already, what's out already. So I know there's volume 0 and like volume like, always like 15 or 16, but it's only in English. I only collect in English, so we have 9, and we now we have 1, 2, 3, 5, 6, and 9. So yeah. Okay, and then the two books I have, which I got, are these two. First one is, they both die at the end. If you're on book talk, you obviously know what this book is. It's actually a book I've been meaning to get for a while. And I finally decided to get it because I was getting this book. And I thought, why not get the book I've always been wanting to get? This one. There is another one I've been wanting, uh, Red, White, and Royal Blue. But I said, hey, let's do this one and then the like straight version of that. <laughs> kind of. So we have the book that die at the end. I really can't wait to read this. I have a ton of books already to read in my TBR pile if you haven't seen it last. But hey, this uh, works just as well, right? And then we have American Royals. So I just saw this cover and I was like, American Royals. Hmm, that actually sounds interesting. And then when you read the back, you can take a pause to look at the back or just look it up. I was like, holy cow, this is really interesting. Like, what if America had a royal family? Like, this just, this is just really cool. I just really wanted to read it, so I just impulsively picked this up, and I regret nothing except for the fact that this book is already damaged. I can't. I think it already came damaged, but this is somehow the best, unda like the best book they had of this. You know what I mean? Like, this is the most undamaged book there. And I was like, how is this possible? I was like, oh, it's the same texture. It's not. Really, it's like the matte texture of like let's say um like fruits basket. Not like um any of these, but like fruits basket. Um, Hitorihime, sells at work mainly like kondashi comics. I think that's what it is. But sometimes not like the larger kondashi comics. Like like also um B stars that kind of series. Okay, and then we're gonna shelve this and then show you where we're just gonna put these two books. This one and. This one. So now you get my cart that's just basically being lit up by my um, desk light. Um, I really don't know if that's really the best solution. I don't have like any ring lights or anything. So that's the best solution I have at the moment. So here we are. I actually don't think we have enough room to fit this book on there. And I don't really want to mingle it with my hero. Because then it just means I am um, <laughs> no more room for that for my hero to expand. Which kind of upsets me because, like, that was one of the first series I decided to collect in January. If you look, remember, the first two volumes I got in January were on um, volume two and volume three of my hero. And it's just like, I've just, it's just been a process of collecting that volume, that series. And I was just like, it brings out like a lot of happy memories, especially because I absolutely love My Hero Academia. So it's like, hmm. I will collect it. It's just, I want it to have its own thing because of how much I appreciate it, love it, all of the above. Like, just like Haikyuu, like every series I want to collect, I want it to have its own shelf, but I can't do that at the moment because I don't have enough room in my house 
from or my room to do it. So after that spiel, I think we actually are just gonna move it because um that just gives more room for jujitsu and haiku to grow. And yeah, but I I will be collecting jujitsu. <laughs> But I will be collecting jujitsu first, and so I hope it will be able to like stay here. Oh, I can feel like I, every time I do that, I just damage the books. That's okay, I think. They're still like in okay condition, but I just need like seven through nine, which is like three volumes, and then zero, which is like one. So like I have room for for at least jujitsu kaisen to fit on here. Hi, Q. I will take a pause on until I'm like determined to collect all of them like not saying i am it's just that i have other series i want to collect like toilet bound jujitsu my hero given and then i think that's it for now so then i get to see the process of me turning this thing i promise i make it sound like i'm struggling more than i actually am so um update i read volume 12 and 13 of my hero so yeah so we're gonna just do them in order so one three Honestly, I sort of can't wait to like, get rid of the cart for the sole- oh, It's already bent. For the sole reason of I'm not able to see like the bottom here. Like, you can't see the characters for my hero. Oops. Okay. Like, there we go. So that's, the, that's like my only complaint, but that's like it. Cause, like, I wouldn't mind clicking like toilet bound or something on a cart. Just because there's no care. <laughs> Sorry! Just because there's no characters on it. Uh, there. I think you saw my dog. Do I ignore my dog? Sometimes. But do I love my dogs? Yes. I did that out of order. It's supposed to be three. I remember three was supposed to go there because it's like the bi-color flag. Bi-flag colors. And I was like, yes. Okay. And then once I put um 14 through 15 here, I don't think I'll have enough space on this side anymore. So that e that would either mean I have to move to other bound as later, or just stop collecting my hero. Don't know which one yet. But anyways, we are going to go to the bookshelf because that's where I'm going to put my regular books. Okay, I lied. With this horrible lighting, I am going to put um these two books up here and just shift those basically. So this is what we're gonna do, just like, shift, shift. <laughs> just that easy. I actually can't wait to read them. I have to read this one and these two, but that's okay. And a crap load of other books, but we ignore them for now. And I think that's all for today. See you in the next clip. Okay, we got new books. I don't know where they're gonna go though, so we'll figure that out later. But Holy Mia, volume one. I'm like actually super excited to get started in collecting this series. Like I read it from my library and it was I was really happy to read it. But but um when I read volume two, um some of the pages were like miscut or something, so I'm like really happy to actually kind of reread it i guess and i tried to watch the anime just wasn't as interested but it's the manga so why not only issue is i accidentally got one with a damaged spine it might be hard to tell but it's like dented it and stuff but it's not too bad so i don't mind and then volume three it's got some stuff on the corners and stuff or on the page i was just <laughs> i was apparently too excited to read this so I did get some damage um, covers and stuff, but I don't mind. That's a, that's a me problem and not um, shipping or otherwise. So yeah. So yeah, volumes 1 and 3 of Holy Mia. I have read all these before, but I just ha I read all the way to volume 6. So I'm really excited to start collecting and reading the series. So yeah. And now we're going to go shelving. <laughs> okay, so... We are officially going to start using that section. Actually, I'm going to leave that there because it's just three volumes. So we're just going to plop them like this, basically. <laughs> we're just going to leave them there until I get more 
manga that can be that can join Hitori Hime or move Hitori Hime to the cart like yeah but this is gonna start being used now it's gonna be kind of scary not gonna lie but yeah um and I actually think that's gonna be all for August manga wise because I did get some stray kids like their recent comeback it's coming out in a couple days let's go so hopefully that will arrive by the time august is over so i can post this manga haul and then the stray kids uh album haul so yeah see you later i guess <laughs>